Hi guys, I received a comment on my profile from Acre Blade. Thanks again for your question. It says, Hi again, Duncan. I've got another question for the teacher. Well, you know. I was going to update my drivers, but I noticed that what a hassle it is to go uh, to all the developers' websites, and I don't even know all the websites for my hardware. So I checked Google, as you should always do before you ask questions, for, for an application that could do it for me. I didn't find, I, I think it means I did find two, Drivers Magician and Drivers Detective, but you can only back up your drivers with those if you don't buy them. Since you've been in the game for a while longer, I, th I think I mean, thought I would check with you if you know it's a nice freeware app. Um, now, thanks for your question again. Um, I wouldn't suggest, to be honest, downloading an application that will check uh, for updates to your drivers all the time, because, to be honest, they don't update drivers that often. I mean, it's, uh, I don't know, I think do every three months or something like that. So I wouldn't suggest getting something that um, downloads them or even automatically downloads new drivers because you don't know. Um, like, for example, with my graphics card, I downloaded a new driver for my graphics card the other day and it blue screened my computer and I couldn't turn it back on and I had to roll back. So I don't want to be able to, I don't want to have it automatically do that. So when I turn on my computer, I can't use it anymore. It's just, um, it'd just be a big hassle. So uh, what I suggest is, um, well, I'll show you what I'm going to do. Basically, you can check your PC online and it will uh, scan your computer. I think you just install a plugin for Firefox or it does it within Explorer or something. It's just a quick plugin and it will search your computer. I'll just show you in action and show you what you can do. So I'm just going to, this is from driveragent.com. As you can see, it's scanning for my drivers. And you've got instant access to 124,000. Now we're not actually going to download them from this website. So you notice know, at driveragent.com. Notice I haven't actually up upgraded my drivers since I bought this computer and um, that was a year ago. So. Uh, you'll notice that good drivers, 93%, bad drivers, 7%. I don't think bad drivers means, oh no, my computer's going to crash. Uh, all bad drivers means is that they're out of date. So 7% um, of my drivers are out of date. So you'll notice that, like I said before, not you, you're not going to want to go and look for every single driver on your system uh, to see if there's an update for it, because h half of them will work anyway. So um, it's best to just do a quick online scan. You can see it's got all the stuff that I've got on my PC here. Um, that need that would need a uh, driver update and you notice it says over here uh, good bad and then it's got a download button now if you click this it will ask you to sign up to their website but we're not going to do that um, because as I've only got 7% of my drivers so it says my NVIDIA GeForce 8400GS is out of date I need to download it um, but I know that if I download the latest uh, Forceware for it it will uh, crash my computer so I'm not going to do it but all I'd need to do is um, either visit nvidia.com and uh, download the latest driver or put all of this into Google and put download on the end and then it will search for download and then you'll find download you just got to make sure the date's fairly recent um, that's exactly the same like for my modem speedtouch 330 it says it's not up to date um, so I just go to the speedtouch or the Thompson website I think I have to do for this one or I just um, put it in uh, Google and put driver on the end. So you don't really have to worry about uh, downloading a freeware application that will use your internet connection and uh, keep checking every five minutes that you have um, new drivers because um, more often than not you're not going to need to update them that much. I mean the most important is probably the graphics card and that's only if you're a gamer um, just so you can play the latest games but I mean to be honest I don't even need to upgrade my modem because it works and my sound, my sound works so um, unless there's a problem um, I'd suggest um, just leaving it as it is so um, this is the way I'd do it I don't know of a freeware application that does it but to be honest I wouldn't want to use one so um, I hope this answers your question Acre Blade I'm sorry if it doesn't if anyone knows of an application that they use to upgrade uh, their drivers automatically or whichever then uh, please let me know and uh, I'll provide the link to this scanning thing in the description you only want to do it for the scan you don't want to download it because you can use Google for that you don't need to go through their site and download several things uh, just to uh, uh, pay $30 a month or whatever they're charging just to download your drivers you just need to know if they're out of date or not so um, thanks for watching my video, please comment, rate, subscribe if you like my videos and thanks again.